YouTube. Now I want to preface this video by saying thanks to Doomface. I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of these Tekken 8 trailers. Now I'm definitely gonna pick up Tekken when it comes out. It just it wasn't really grabbing me like some of the other fighting games that's coming out uh, here next year. Oh well, this year. And I just was like, ah, I don't know if I want to do them all. But he was like, you gonna do Kings? You should do this one. I'm just like, all right. So I'm gonna go ahead and do Lars and backtrack. Lars was the latest one that came out. Here we go. Like and sub. Let's see what we got here. There you go. <laughs> they changed that too. Get ready for the next battle. The line of the value. I like the lightning already. Now, I remember when I first went against this character and played with him. I feel like I was playing with a Dragon Ball character in Tekken. He actually had an outfit from uh, Naruto. Directly from Naruto. Uh, his design looks pretty cool. I know a lot of people are not a fan of the belt and the hanging stuff, but I am. Looks a lot like, uh, old boy from Final Fantasy. Okay. Still got that little... Okay, he definitely has the best one to me so far. These trailers are so cool. We don't even need to like no preview of the next character. Um, all right, let's back up right here. Uh, a little bit more. So he still has all of his uh moves from the first one. I didn't play with him a lot. Let's look at his design right quick. Uh, so look at this. Got this little eight. It's like an infinite going on here. It's glowing. It's pretty cool. A lot of lion stuff going on. So I, I need to look back at his story because I remember I, I, he was considered a Mishima at first, right? And then um, as you kept playing with him, you find out that he wasn't part of that line or something. He's being tricked or something. But uh, this is pretty cool. I actually drew a character with this kind of same thing, but I didn't consider it glowing um, for another fighting game, actually. But uh, anyway, um, his design is pretty cool. The name of that character from Final Fantasy is... Uh, I know his name, man. It's the guy that sits in a wheelchair. Oh, it's escaping me. But it reminds me, it, it looks exactly like that. A heat. And with the flips, he still got a lot of... Yeah, he still got like all of his... Um, he was like really like acrobatic in his combat. I think the most ever when he first came out in Tekken to me anyway. This one right here, look at this. Come in with the lightning. Yeah, he definitely has the best one so far. Let me back up just a bit again. Face look really dope. Got that move. He's still beating your tail. I know that much. Oh, well, you can stop me. Low to mids. Heat rush into the dive kick. Yeah, what is that? That's what I want to see again. What is that? Is that a kind of a guard break? OK. 
Okay, let's get some good pause action here. So yeah, it's pretty he's pretty cool, man. <laughs> this looks even is 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 looking even better now. I'm really feeling the super. And all of his combat though looks like it's intact from the uh previous Tekkens. Um and Tekken, I played with Lily the most. And I, I would I would mess with Jen until he changed. I mean, he's still really cool, but he changed. And then uh, Kazuya. But I was my go-to's was always um, Kazuya, Lily, and oh man, oh Heihachi's girl that was had dealings with Akuma in the last one. Forgot her name, man. There's so many Tekken characters. But yeah, so Lars is pretty cool. Look forward to the King trailer next. Thank you for watching.